Disappointing, definitely. Not so much that I couldn't finish the game, but just, you know, the circumstances that it was under. So, yeah, definitely uh, disappointing. Um, I've never really had a hamstring issue before, so, I mean, it's really tough to say. I mean, it doesn't, I'm not in, like, agonizing pain or anything like that, so I don't, you know, really feel uh, that it's, you know, too bad. Jorge did indicate that you said you heard a pop, though. Right, yeah, and you know, I think um, I think you do with most hamstrings, or you know, so I'm told. So, um, yeah, there was a little bit of a pop, and but you know, it's not like um, you know, there's no like sharp pain or anything like that. Did you want to leave the game? Um, I really, I didn't have any choice. I mean, I, if I was to to try to uh, you know stride and throw, there would have been no way I could, um, you know, no way I could I, I even pitch. So, well, can you remember what you were thinking at that exact moment? Um. You know, it's tough to say. I, I was kind of flustered. Um, you know, I was disappointed, obviously, but um, you know, it's just uh, it's just one of those unfortunate circumstances. You know, and you know, there's not really much you can do about it except uh, you know try to get better and you know come back as quick as I can. Um. No, I wasn't. Uh, I wasn't really thinking about it too much. You know, I just uh, was really just focusing on the uh, the next pitch and, and stuff like that. So you know, I wasn't you know really thinking about you know finishing the game, just you know getting the next guy. When you pitched it to Sharon, curveball. Curveball. Yeah, I really you know it was 0-2. I really just wanted to finish it and you know kind of overextended over my front foot a little bit, and I think that's probably what did it. So. When you look at early in your start, Phil, I think it was three straight change-ups to get him in the first. How much did that set a tone for you having such command tonight? Um, it did a lot, actually, especially to, to Shara. And, you know, maybe the other guys had it in the back of their mind a little bit, too, that I'd throw that pitch. So um, I think it really showed um, in the, the at-bat that I um, hurt the hamstring where, you know, he was – it was almost like he was looking for that change-up and he was kind of behind the fastball a little bit. So – I think, um, you know, once I established that and that I was going to throw my curveball for strikes and commanding the fastball, everything kind of worked out. For only your second start, how close was this to anything you could have expected until obviously the hamstring? Um, you know, I, I always knew that I kind of, you know, had this ability in me. It was just a matter of, of going out and really, you know, not letting anything else in my head, just, you know, attacking the hitters. And, um, you know, I felt very relaxed tonight and just, um, you know, focused on the pitches I need to make. And, um, you know, it was... Uh, Everything was working out up to until you know, the seven. Um, well, the first start, you know, I was really tentative. Um, you know, I had a other, bunch of other emotions kind of rattling around my head. And you know, tonight I was just, you know, aggressive with them, just you know, going after each guy, and um, you know, really just focusing on you know the pitch I had to make and you know the hitter and you know nothing else. You're so calm and collected. Is there any frustration, disappointment, physical pain beneath the surface? Um, not really any physical pain right now. Um, you know, I'm definitely frustrated though. You know, it's tough to, you know, especially when you, um, you know, a team really needs a win and, you know, we got it tonight and, you know, it's just going to be, you know, disappointing in the next, you know, five, ten days when, you know, I'm not going to be out there and, and, uh, you know, we're at a point right now where our rotation really needs it. So it's going to be tough.